hey guys welcome to coding simplified and today we'll solve a new problem in binary search tree where our aim is to get the in order parent of a given value so here's the difference between parent and in order parent is that for example uh, if you see the six so the parent of six is three but the parent but the in order parent is eight means the parent should be the greater than the asked value so if you are asking the in order parent of 6 then the parent should be the greater than 6 so here in order parent of 6 will 8 same the in order parent of 7 is 8 now the in order parent of 1 is 3 right because uh, if you see the parent then 3 is the just greater than 1 now in order parent of 4 is 6 because 6 is the only value which is just greater than 4 now in order parent of 13 is 14 now in order of parent of 14 is null because there is no such value which is uh, whose parent the parent of 14 is not greater than which is null so we'll say the in order parent doesn't exist now you will also say in order parent doesn't exist if there is no such values which you are finding in the tree right for example if you say what is in order of 20 so if 20 doesn't exist here it means there is no in order parent right so we'll solve this problem okay so what should be the our logic the logic should be that we'll start from the root and we'll keep on going left and whenever we will keep on going left then we'll store the previous value as in order parent and then we'll move the left but if we are moving to the right then we won't keep the value because if we are moving the right right then obviously the the right value will always be the greater than the this value so obviously that can't be our in order parent so we want to store the value if we are moving to right we'll store the value only if we are moving to left so let's say if we are uh, if you are finding out the in order parent of six so first we'll start from root so we'll move left so now we'll store the value which is eight this is our in order parent now we are moving right so we want to store so as soon as we find out the 6 we'll break from the loop so our in order parent is 8 so that is my answer but let's see if you are finding the in order parent of 1 so starting from the root you will start from the 8 you will move 3 now again you are moving to left so your in order parent will shift to 3 so now value here is matching so it will break from the loop and your in order parent is 3 right now this is uh, this is the problem this is how we will solve the problem logic now what would be the complexity so complexity will be the big of log uh, log n because in log n we are solving the problem right because that is the quality of bht we have the uh, we have the all the less values and greater value so at that time we are traversing only in one uh, only one section either right or left so we'll will able to solve the problem in big of log n right and similar and same is the complexity of when we are finding the sibling node or the parent node right so let's see how we can solve so uh, we'll pass the root node and we'll pass the value which we want to find out and then uh, we'll say if in order parent node is null is not null then simply print the value else we'll say parent doesn't exist so let's take example of three first and write a function so first of all we'll say that if node is null then simply return null right else we'll start from null and here we'll write get uh, or in order parent is null okay and here uh, we'll say if value is less than uh, node of data then shift node equals to node of data sorry node of left else if value is greater than node of data then shift 
नोड इक्वल टू नोड ऑफ राइट ओके एंड इफ वैल्यूज आर इक्वल देन दिस केस ब्रेक बिकॉज नाउ विल अचीव आवर गोल ओके सो नाउ हेयर द पॉइंट दैट वेन एवर वी आर मूविंग टू लेफ्ट दैन वी विल स्टोर द प्रीवियस वैल्यू सो विल से इन ऑर्डर पेरेंट इक्व टू नोड राइट एंड हेयर सो नाउ हेयर विल चेक दैट इफ नोड इज नल इट मीन्स द वैल्यू डिजेंट एग्जिस्ट इन द ट्री विच आर फाइंडिंग आउट इट मीन्स सिंपली रिटर्न नल सो विल से रिटर्न एंड इफ नोड इज नॉट नल देन इन दिस केस यू कैन रिटर्न इन ऑर्डर पेरेंट else you can return null right so that will solve our problem so now let's see that whether it is fulfilling all the conditions or not I start from the debug which is better so it will go here now node is 8 and value is 3 which you want to find out so now 3 is less than 8 so it will store the in order parent as 8 and it will move to left now values are equal so it will break from the loop now uh, node is not null right so it will print, it will send you the in order parent which is 8 so it will simply return the 8 right now let's see that if you want to find out the in order parent of 6 so start the debugging now 6 is greater than 8 so it will move to left it will store in order parent as node now again 6 is greater than 3 so it will go to right now you can see so uh, we are not storing so in order parentage is still 8 so now values are equal so it will go out of the loop and it will give you in order parentage 8 right so that is that is how it is giving you value 8 and similarly if you go for the 7 same is the case when you are shifting the right then we want to store will store whenever you are shifting left so at the first case we are storing next we are storing we are going right so we want to store again we are going right we want to store and then values are matching it will go out of the loop it will return the in order parent node which is 8 right so this is how we can solve now let's say if you want to find out the in order parent of 13 so the it will be the same logic and if you run the program it would be print 14 which is correct but let's say now check some negative case cases so now 14 so let's debug so 14 is greater than 8 so it will go in right so it will say it want to store any value again 14 is greater than 10 now node is again so node is now 14 okay so values are matching but our so here it will check and here in order parent is null right because it, it never hit the actual in order parent and initially we uh, declared it null so it is null as well so if you are returning so it will say in order parent doesn't exist right now let's say if you want to search the in order parent of 8 which is also null so run the program because there is no in order parent right there is no parent of it so it should give you null so here uh, node is not null so it will say in order parent okay here now at the first itself it will break so in order parent is null because it is not it will it want to go in left and right so it want to store in order parent and it will return you in order parent which is null so in order parent does not exist right and let's take one value where it doesn't exist in the loop so 18 so if you search the 18 it will say 18 is greater than 8 so right 18 is greater than 10 again right 18 is greater than 14 again right so it want to store any value so node is null in this case so it will simply return null right so that's it guys so we have covered all the cases all the edge cases for this problem and that is how we can find out the in order parent of a given value the complexity is log n right 
and this is very fast process to find out the in order parent of a given value so thanks guys for watching the video and uh, in next tutorial we'll see some more problems for bht thanks for watching if you have got your answer then please like the video and please subscribe the channel for more such videos thank you